Welcome to Lapua. Here we have 700 two-stroke dirt bike. There is a big ass swing arm because this bike will be hill and climb bike. Uh, we asked you guys that what kind of project we should do and you guys said that do a 700 two-stroke bike and that's why we are here today because we're gonna use that engine not not that engine but engine like that on our project and our plan is to uh, do uh, 700 cc two-stroke supermoto we're gonna buy uh, KTM maybe 250 four-stroke take the engine off from that bike and replace the engine with that big ass two stroke engine. This bike is designed to go on water also. There is a uh, water kit on it and the owner of the bike is here. He has rode that bike on water a lot and the max speed on water is a little over uh, 80 kilometers per hour. So it's quite fast on water. The engine produced somewhere near uh, over 80 horsepower. Impressive. Okay, Matthias did a couple laps, so the engine is now warm and now it's Juha's time to go test ride this beast. <laughs> it's your time! Yeah. I just say it's insane. I'm a bit scared. I will ride like sissy with that. Matthias told us that with that engine there is one minus when you're racing ice track like, like this one here. Uh, you can't use engine braking like not, not at all. Yes, you will, you will burn the burn the engine. So I need to be careful with that.
Minkäköhän selä? En mieti. Tossa jossain se on. Mä käyn hakee kärry! Eturatas läis helvetti! Hyvä! That vibrates so hard that you can't feel your hands. It's insane. <laughs> if, if we ca can't reduce the vib vib vibration, I will never enjoy riding that supermoto. Yeah. Like never. <laughs> and the engine braking, because you can't do that, it's quite hard actually to ride it because you are thinking it all the time that yeah. Don't do it, don't do it, you're gonna destroy the engine. <laughs> really hard. So, like, of course we're gonna do the project. We're gonna build the two-stroke for 700 supermoto. But the question is that, is it even good to ride? I don't know. Because we need to, we need to reduce the vibration a lot. Yeah. Because I can't fucking feel my hands. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on a. It's awful. Yeah. Not even full throttle. Like <clears throat> semi open throttle. <laughs> <laughs> like halfway open. And it's vibrating like. Like. On the elbow. <laughs> and after the elbow, you start feeling your hands. <laughs> but it's vibrating so fast. And it's, it's something I haven't felt ever. It's like fucking huge dildo. <laughs> <laughs> huge dildo where it's like 80 horsepower. <laughs> awesome noise though. Awesome sounds. We need to build one of those dildos. <laughs> yeah, only the front sprocket flew away, so nothing too serious. The bike uh, isn't broken or anything like that, so everything is good. Uh, thanks to Matthias who borrowed the bike for us and uh, he gave a lot of good tips how we gonna build our own 700 two-stroke supermoto and he will help us to build it 700 cc two-stroke supermoto we're gonna build it in our stage in MP Messut this year it's the biggest bike expo here in Finland uh, so if you're interested come by and you know see us and see the project look big crash <laughs> huge high cider there yeah but anyway thanks for all the dudes here uh, in Lapua. This was awesome, awesome day here in Lapua. And yeah, very awesome, very fast.